If you think games are great and have tons of content right now, get ready for when the machines start analyzing our every move and design fun content on the fly. Watch out everyone, there's a new game master in town. Hello Virtual Dreamers, Gregory here. Doing the exact same thing over and over can get pretty boring for us non-speedrunning mortals, so games have been adding stuff for us to do to vary things up basically since their inception. You have your standard artist slash developer made levels, characters, music, and other ramen fueled creations that have produced some of the best stories and gameplay loops of all time. Then you have the games that are designed to basically build themselves, working off a core gameplay loop where the procedure assures you get something a little different every time you play. The final method involves us making our own fun, by having developers give us a toolset and letting us run wild by either creating our own content, having us play with each other, or against one another inside of multiplayer games. These have been the tried and true methods for games, and have been the foundation for some of the greatest games of all time. But they're not exactly without their flaws. Artists need to eat, believe it or not, and without infinite money and time, the results you can get from them only go so far. Procedural generation can offer limitless variety to be sure, but I don't need an infinite variety of crap in my game when life shits on me to the excess every day. Finally, multiplayer depends heavily on people, which means without talented people jumping on a hype bandwagon to make a name for themselves or a competitive scene to score e-fame in, most multiplayer games struggle to get off the ground. And of course, it isn't the developer's fault that we have no friends, but we're gonna blame that on them anyway. It seems like a lot to deal with, but a certain branch of technology that's been growing rapidly lately is gonna try to help us out. Enter artificial intelligence. Now if that ain't a buzzword you've heard lately, I'll put the technical definition on the screen here, but in plain English, artificial intelligence algorithms are basically code that make virtual interns that learn on the job, get better than the bosses, and do tons of work, but get no respect or upward mobility for their efforts. Damn, that's tough, girl. Anyhow, the reason we're talking about them now is thanks to the increase in CPU horsepower that's going to be available on consoles and PCs, thanks to AMD, improved internet infrastructure making the cloud even better, and machine learning improving AI efficiency. Now that you know what AI are, and why we're talking about them, let's go over what AI development offers us that the other three methods struggle with. Starting with artist blood, sweat, and tear made levels, one of the trickier aspects of creating levels and content is having to adapt to the player. Every human is different, and there isn't a one size fits all approach for things like difficulty, time availability, or user endowment. For a while now though, developers have used pseudo AI algorithms to analyze what is happening in the game and adjust what's happening to get a better result, like with Left 4 Dead's AI Director or Resident Evil 4's Adaptive Difficulty. The new bit here is the potential for using machine learning algorithms to have the AI itself develop new strategies or adjust parameters for making the game better for each player. Since we obviously can't have individual artists handle every player on the noodle budgets that we're working with here. This should all happen pretty much without developer input over time, which actually brings us to the other set of algorithms in development that will benefit from AI, the procedural generation stuff. The big glowing weak point of said algorithms is their lack of taste, if you will. Procedural algorithms can make worlds that match logical patterns or the developer's vision to a T. But they can't always make sure that our visions don't suck. With the addition of our AI Game Master friends, who are constantly analyzing how our play experience is going, they'll have the chance to spice things up if they're getting stale or prevent from getting past the radar. You know, put some diamonds in the next chunk in front of you. Maybe send a shiny Pokemon after you get 50 Magikarps in a row. Even get you a camper-free game in Modern Warfare. Now that ain't magic, holy sh**. Speaking of, that brings us to one of the largest areas where improved AI will have an impact. Multiplayer. While I won't tell you to expect our super AI friends in games anytime soon, 
they're basically only about as good at talking as Alexa, Google Assistant, and Siri. Plus, they have thoroughly asserted their dominance this past decade. But I do think we are going to notice their handiwork more in the behind the scenes stuff going forward. Having an AI that gets better at timing loot spawns, grouping compatible people together, or even learns when we need to nerf a character for balancing would be great for development. There's a good chance the only reason you're even watching this video is because my AI goddess, Algorithm Ojolsama, ordained to bring you to my little corner of the web. Ultimately, the AI's sole occupation is going to be analyzing our experience to bring us joy. And if the metric for player joy online is matching us with people who engage and enrich us, then couldn't it be said that these AI game masters are bringing us together? When I think of it that way, I can't help but feel a bit grateful. Nobody say echo chambers. AI is becoming a bigger and bigger deal in our lives, and it's going to be interesting to see this new team member's output in the future. Whether they're figuring out the best time to give us a rare drop, making sure the world procedure system doesn't dump on us, or maybe just playing virtual matchmaker, I want this video to serve as a friendly greeting to our AI over <coughs> comrades in the field. I have much more I want to say on the matter of AI, in particular with regards to the morality of human-like AI, as time goes on, but that goes beyond the scope of this video. For now, just know that there's going to be a new group of game masters in town, and they're going to be relentless in the pursuit of good times. Also, praise to my benevolent goddess, YouTube algorithms have Made it to the end of the video? Awesome. Be sure to let Algorithm Sama know that you like the video. Subscribe in order to get more of these puppies. Comment down below to share your opinion. Join the Discord's link for even more discussion. And share this video to help me out. Till next time, my fellow adventurers and dreamers. This has been Gregory. Logging out.